Okay, next drill we can do or is there going to be our uh, T drill for quickness of the feet. Um, on the ground we have some tape uh, drawn out there. I'm going to have Derek just go side to side laterally and this is for quickness so we're going to go as quick as possible here. So Derek go ahead and give us a couple there. Notice how his toes are staying straight ahead. Go ahead and show us one more time. Toes straight ahead. Great. Toes and knees straight ahead. He's not moving around at all. Not, feet aren't going out and feet aren't doing any kind of this. Not looking like a skier in any fashion. Going side to side, you can go front to back in this drill. So he'll show front to back. And then he can go diagonal as well. So, and obviously he'll go in the other diagonal as well. You can even do transverse plane. You can rotate, just cross that line here. Very nice. You can see he's doing a great job of keeping those toes straight ahead, keeping his lower extremities in control, uh, really decreasing the risk of injury. Um, if you have your uh, elderly client, youth, whatever it may be, you don't have to go 100% on this the entire time. If you're going to introduce this, this drill to your client, start them off about 50%. Let them get used to just hopping over something and tell them, let them see where you want their feet at. Then from there, you can begin to gradually speed them up. Once they've done it two feet, you can get them into one foot. Derek will show us side to side on one foot. Very nice. And then obviously you can switch sides and then you can go front to back as well. Go in front to back and then real quick add in that diagonal. Beautiful. So we're getting multiple planes of motion, two feet, one feet. Great drill uh, to be used with any type of client really.